This your boy Brandon. Yeah, that's right. The coolest YouTuber ever. And I'm back with another, another Batman video. And in this video, as you can see, and as you read that title, yes, I have the Slim Armor Pro front for the Galaxy Z Fold 2 from Speaking. It's a design for Samsung. Protection and cover case. This is supposed to be the best case that you can buy as of right now for the Galaxy Z Fold 2. It's a little pricey, but I've been through a bunch of cases. If you've seen previous videos on the channel, you'll see I've been through, been through a bunch of, bunch of cases and it just, <laughs> they didn't work out right. So people recommend this when I've seen a couple other videos and they say this is the best one. So if you ready, I'm ready. Right after that intro, let's go. Box this real quickly. So probably gonna be like a little bulky case, but it's probably the best one. Okay. Oh, it's a two piece. Okay. So it's like this. Okay, yeah. I've I seen a couple of videos that they had the black one. But I never seen the one that they had um, the bronze one. Oh, yeah, I like that. Cover the hinge. This is nice. Y'all see that? Even that material. The speaking logo on it. Cutout's perfect. If y'all hear my kids in there, they're acting crazy. All right. Oh, yeah, okay. So you peel these off. Y'all can see that. You peel these little tabs off. What's this okay, like some type of soft rubber, but you peel the tabs off these little adhesive. I guess it just help keep the, the Z fold a little more secure, okay? Yeah, oh, okay, so you open it, that's nice. It don't feel cheap at all, I feel like it's made out of good materials. What does it say on here? Oh, come with extra little adhesive strips just in case you need it, and it shows you how to. Put everything on the front and back. I like this. This is a nice presentation. How you hold everything. Okay. All right. Let me go grab the Z Fold. I'll be right back. I didn't put it on there. All right, so I'm back. I threw the um the case on it real quick. Really easy to put together. You just really slide it in. Is it? That's why I didn't really show explaining it how to do it is real easy come with these extra little adhesive strips if you need them just slide it in together but i wanted to um take a day or two it's been two days since i um bought the case so i want to take a couple of days and see how i liked it so if i can give you guys my you know my actual honest opinion and let you guys know if it's worth the i think i paid 89 dollars for this case let me be honest, it is. I've had a lot of cases, and this is the best case as of right now for the Galaxy Z Fold 2. Like the ports, if you can see all the ports, everything works. You can get to everything, speaker grilled, every this, every the mics, everything is just flawless. Like this covers the the hinge, just everything. Everything. See, even you can get to this. Oh, let me unlock it. There you go. Uh -oh. Why keep doing it? All right. You can get to the, um, that. So you got to kind of play with it a little bit, but you can get to it. It ain't, it ain't bad at all. Yeah. You just got to get used to it. That's all. But it's, um, we're perfect. Like you could get to your camera, the speaker, cut out the top, everything in it got like a little raise to it. I don't know if you can see that, but it got like a little raise. So you can actually put it down and not worry about it. And this has a little raise on the back. So you can actually put that down and not worry about it. And then even when you open it, even when you open it, it's flawless. It, it works perfect. Like you can see how you don't, like some of the other cases, this falls off. For those who have the Z Fold 2, you know what I'm talking about. This part 
can fall off. The back normally always been good on all the cases that I've tried, but this one is flawless. It doesn't come off. The adhesive is strong. I don't know how, you know, through time of me taking it out, putting it into another phone, how that's going to work. But this is, this is perfect. I can't, you get the, you can get to everything. Nothing is like messing up the, if you still got the screen protector or a screen protector on, it's not, it's not going to get to it. Even if you slam it this way or, you know, turn your uh, Z Fold down this way, it's still raised up. Raise up a perfect amount. I definitely think this is the, I like that wallpaper, at 4D. But yeah, I think it's the perfect cake. Uh, let's see. You just got to get your hand in there. Yeah, come on. Get your hand in there. There you go. You got to get your hand in there. You got to get used to it, just getting in there. Oh, I, I got mine smaller too. I need to make that bigger. That's not, Let me do that now. I'm going here and make that... Uh, Let's go in here and make this bigger. That's the problem is I made it too small. I forgot. Let's go in here. Uh, reorder. I don't need to reorder it. I need to uh, go here. Edge panel. Let's see. Make it bigger. There we go. Now I'll be able to get to it easier. Okay. So now let's look. Yeah. Yeah. See. Let's do it from that. Yeah. See, I just need to make it bigger. It was a little smaller in there. But yeah, once you make this a little bigger, you know, your uh, edge panel, once you make that bigger, you can get to it easy. But if, as you can see, everything is covered. Nothing is showing. The hinge is not showing. Like, this is the best ca uh, case. If you was on the, on the fence of um, picking this case up, I'm telling you right now, this is the best case. It's a little expensive. And yes, I'm sure you you uh, probably want to know, does it make it bulky? It does, but to protect your $2,000 phone, it's definitely worth it being bulky. Trust me, it's definitely worth it. I would 100%, 100% recommend anyone get this case. And the one reason why I wanted to get it in review is because I haven't seen as many with this color. So I wanted to you know, show you guys this, this color one, this bronze type of case. Everybody I've seen videos, I'm sure somebody, but everybody I've seen had the black, case but yeah i just wanted it to match whatever and uh it does i don't got no cloth to wipe my stuff on though that's the only thing about these phones is i don't have one right now is the um all these fingerprints you know but it's cool every this this case is flawless flawless now when you set it down it do do that though if you want to set it down on something so it's best to probably get you like a little stand or something. Let me grab this stand real quick. Probably best to get you like some type of stand. Set it in. Prop it up. Prop it up. Watch your movies. Watch a little Netflix. Netflix and chill. Whatever you're doing. You know, prop it up like that. So. I like this little case too. I actually did a video, I think, on this one. I believe I did. But now watching it like this is actually perfect. Yeah, because it got it gives you a little angle. And you can still do your like this. You can still all do that perfectly. Well, you know, and actually you you don't have to worry about the hands getting all scratched up. Or even the back screen, because it's raised up. So you can even do it this way and watch it. Like if you was watching the movie, like how the background is playing on here. I don't know if y'all can see that like that. But yeah, I don't know. Yeah, but yeah, put it about right there, boom. If you got a movie on or something. But this case, it's on the little bulky side, but it's worth it. It feels good because this is the reason, like I say, I, I took a couple of days. I wanted to have it in my pocket. See how I feel. Did it hurt? Was it just that noticeably heavy? And it's not. So it does add bulk, of course, but it's, it's definitely not, it's not heavy at all. It's perfect. And this is, this don't get fingerprints. Like, I don't know if you can see that. You could keep that clean easy. You see the fingerprint on the camera, but this doesn't. This whole thing does not get fingerprints. And it's a good, solid quality materials that they use. So it's not like they um just cheapen out and do something together real quick and charge you 90 bucks for it. No, they actually 
took time, Spigen, shout out to them, they took time to put together something beautifully crafty. Like, this is amazing. Like, just the thought of this, to be able to protect it, and then it opens up so easy. Let's open up so you can see it like this. It opens up and locks in place like that. Like, that is, that is just perfect. And you don't have to worry about this part falling off. I went through about three, four cases, if you've seen on the channel, early, uh, by a few months ago. And, uh, yeah, went through about a bunch of cases, and it was just, that part was horrible. But if you got any questions, let me know. I answer all questions. That's one thing I do on the channel. I answer every question I can get to. It may take a couple of days, but I definitely get to them all. But, uh, yeah, my final verdict, like I said, is I do recommend this um, this case for all the Z Fold 2 owners. And, um, yeah, stay tuned because I do have um, a four, what has it been, four months? I think four or five months review video on what's on my Z Fold 2 and is it worth buying in 2021 knowing the Z Fold 3 is coming out in a few months. So yeah, with that being said, this your boy Brandon. Yeah, that's right. The coolest YouTuber ever. Signing off, checking out with another video. And yeah, to the next one. Peace.